My name is uh, Lieutenant Jordan Ramos. My uh, MOS is 74 Alpha, which is a Seaburn officer. Seaburn meaning chemical, biological, radiological, and nuclear. And my role is to primarily advise or assist on all things that would have to do with those kinds of threats. Speaking at the platoon level, it would be um, to lead a Seaburn, a, a hazmat assessment platoon on their reconnaissance mission. Seaburn is an excellent MOS and the reason that is is because you do get so technically trained and um, it's just much more than people may think looking in. A lot of times when people hear the word Seaburn they think mop gear which is the big crazy suit with the mask but there's a lot more involved it does get much more technical. One of the coolest things we do is the dismounted reconnaissance so someone has gone in and found a clandestine lab and now you have to go in and identify what is a threat in that lab and get samples and this could potentially save you know millions of lives just by identifying that threat and then mitigating it appropriately so we are constantly constantly training um, so what we aim to do is we'll have a lab set up and then uh, have the platoons sent in to kind of do the dismounted recon so they'll go in with all of our equipment identify which areas which zones are contaminated what the posture would be they radio these things back to me so that we can make the appropriate decisions and proceed forward with the mission make sure that they're fully protected before we get them closer and closer to the threat then they would go in take their samples most likely and then bring those back out decon themselves and then we would send those samples off to a lab as a seaburn officer after you complete your uh, primary training you will end your schooling with a uh, certification in hazmat technician. This is a really valuable certificate because it translates to the private sector as well and you can use it in a variety of hazmat uh, related fields to include FEMA, fire departments, and even the FBI.